Hello my soccer universe and if you're celebrating Merry Christmas to you and I hope you're having a great time with your family, friends and I hope there have also been some really nice and good presents for you but you know the most important thing about this time of the year is to be together and celebrate with each other at least this was it has been for me on the other side you see me coming from a completely different perspective this is the other side of my office uh the one that i'm usually looking at when i'm shooting the videos and it is because the jersey that i got this year for christmas which was basically my only christmas present so far it fits right in the category with my most special jerseys that I have. And you see here, these are three of my most cherished jerseys that I find so special that I want to see them every day. This one, and I will show you in a second, is easily, easily the most special jersey. By just what it represents, how it got to me and so on, it is easily the most special jersey. Now, I have been aware that I have this, I'm getting this jersey. It has not been a, a surprise. And it's usually what I tend to do, you know, you know, drop some hints um, to, uh, you know, organize it a little bit because, you know, for Christmas, either I want to be nicely surprised or I want to have something really special. This falls squarely into the letter CAD category. And this jersey has been a long time in the making and I was able to acquire it, it through my good friend Matt from Football Shirts for Dementia who gave me the opportunity to be able to acquire that one. So huge thanks to him for that because I, and I will tell you in a second, I never thought it possible to have this shirt. And also big thanks to my wife who fully supported me in acquiring the shirt to say okay this is worth the funds that we're about to spend i'm not telling you the sum but yeah let's put it it was not cheap but she was fully supporting me and wrapped it nicely and all kind of stuff so thanks love for that as well so let me show you first then i'll show a little story and then we'll look at it a little bit closer my christmas present comes into this really 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 nice box now this box is from momento market or ac momento and it contains a match worn shirt now this st uh, the story my buddy matt and i have to link his video uh, to this shirt up here this box was a donation uh, for his charity work uh, uh, for dementia research and I remember he was contacting me that there is, he got this special shirt. It's a match one shirt from a team that's very near and dear to my heart. I'm wearing Lask. Lask match one jersey is well special or not. It's an AC Milan match one jersey. And I remember that he's unpacking it uh, and kind of texting me at the same time uh and saying yeah it's a milan shirt and it has a very very special player and the first thing i thought is oh this is so cool i'm so happy for him that he has this and that he has to give it or it has is able to give it away there was literally pure happiness for him that he could hold something like this and I told my wife a, a, a little bit and then I was kind of thinking, hmm, actually, since he has to give it more or less away, since this was the stipulations that he wants to raise money for his char charity, I said, I think I should have this shirt. I'm a huge Milan fan, you know that. I think I should have this shirt. Um, I made myself an upper limit. And literally the price that he mentioned was on this upper limit. I said, well, it's a done deal. And I think within short time we had it arranged. Uh, we said, we're not going to send it via mail since he was coming. And this was, I want to say July. Uh, he was, Matt was already thinking about visiting uh, here to watch a last game. And so we came, yeah, when you come, 
you bring it. It happened in early November and the jersey was coming into my family's possession and I, we were uh, having some dinner and basically he handed me the box with the two other shirts that I'm linking up here uh, uh, with the uh, reveal and I gave it directly to my wife and said that's my Christmas present. Now Matt was really flabbergasted you're not gonna open this here and Matt if you wanted to see me opening uh, with the impression I understand but please un understand for me this is so special it had to be a Christmas present. It was also the only way that it was kind of justifiable to fit in my budget so um, I hope this video here will slightly make up for it. So Let's open up the box. You first get here some text of saying that this is a special moment of football in history. It is. It definitely is. <laughs> this was born at the San Siro, so that already makes it special. There's the inside box. Let's open that one. The inside box. And here's the shirt. QR code. You see already this is the Milan Thurger from last season. I will mention it just in a bit. I'm taking this off as well. Shirt with Scudetto. And let's take it out of the box. So very carefully. It's actually also the AC Momento logo is also on the inside here. It is the Milan third shirt. It has all the patches, all the sponsors. Serie A patch of course. This is of course heat applied. It's very interesting. It's this very thin material. And if you don't know, if you have not seen Matt's video, here's the player on the back. Olivier Giroud, World Cup winner and also the guy that more or less made it possible for Milan to become champion in 21, 20, uh, 2022. And what makes this extra special is he not only wore this, in a game that Milan won, he already scored the winning goal in this one. Can it be any better? Teo Hernandez can deliver. Fine ball for Giroud! A huge sigh of relief for Milan! Now I do not have really a hanger here, <laughs> so I have to do it the old way that I'm hold, hold holding up. Um, first off, before we talk about the specifics of this shirt, um, the material it's really really thin and this is actually a relatively thick layer here on the side which yeah is really really it's almost paper like it reminds me very much of the 2006 material the puma had they said this is ultra lightweight i would think so that this is ultra lightweight i'm not sure how comfortable it is and we saw at the world cup last year that you know when it gets hot this might not be the best material uh because you know it kind of gets stuck to your body but yeah uh, it's definitely interesting you know it's all heat bonded seams you see it here on the side a little bit heat bonding and if you go on the inside this is really 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 special now um, this shirt as is was worn of the 10th of February this year 23 Milan against Torino 1-0 and the goal scorer and I'm linking the video of the highlights up here, Olivier Giroud in the 62nd minute. And the funny thing is, I do remember this game for being excruciatingly boring at the beginning. Where I was thinking they're wearing this shirt to basically hide <laughs> because it's camouflage in a way. And then it ended up with a non-glorious win. It was kind of this rough portion of Milan's uh, last season, but one where they turned it around. So in that sense, it is quite nice and in the end they actually pushed on into the Champions League. Now this is league worn of course and I have to say uh, if you watch my jersey review 
for Milan last season, I was not very complimentary of this jersey and I, in a way, the design, well, I get that there is a um, uh, cross design here to the flag of Milan, which is also representative in the logo. The design itself, I'm never, uh, I, I was never so fond of these uh, type of colors jersey, you know, the more uh, khaki or, you know, military look jerseys. However, I gotta say, with this bright sponsor here, and especially the sponsor here at, uh, on the back and also the outline, this was really hard to read, but there's something about it that there's this outline here that actually makes this a much better jersey. And it's a little bit, little bit of an irony that one of the Milan jerseys of the last years that I was probably least fond of is now the most special one in my collection. I mean, worn by Olivier Giroud in my world, and I'm not in a match-worn space. I'm just your regular collector. In my world, this is about as special as it can be. So yeah, it has here the really nicely, the monochrome tag here. This is, uh, it's had all kinds of colors. That oh. And I think the camera will not pick, pick it up. There's quite a nice, um, pattern inside of the Scudetto, really nice. As I said, this is all uh, plastic transform, so it's super, super lightweight. Uh, the heaviest thing might well be the Serie A patch right here, but yeah, directly from the Mil directly from Milan, worn by Olivier Giroud, it cannot get better than this. Uh, when I said heat bond, it seems I also see here that uh, for the sleeves, these are actually sewn, so I find this also rather interesting. On the body here, there's heat bonded, and here there are regular seams. Hmm. Very, very, very interesting. <laughs> very, very interesting. That much is for sure. Well, let me know if what you think for, of this jersey. As I said, this will need to get a special place. Yeah. But this one, amazing. Absolutely, absolutely amazing. I cannot tell you how much I'm proud to own this piece of Milan history, if you would like. So yeah, thanks again to Matt for enabling me to acquire this jersey. And again, thanks to my wife for allowing me to get this one. I'm squarely happy. I don't think it can be topped. I will release the, the, this week my top 10 jerseys that I acquired this year, number one. I don't think we have to discuss that. But in any case, watch for the other videos. I may actually say number one is this, and here are 10 other shirts that are quite nice. <laughs> in any case, please let me know what you think about this jersey. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more unpacking videos, and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you may enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye.